Tara's over there filming us. She's filming some kind of intro or something. It's a little behind the scenes. But we're uh, over here in Saratoga Springs. We have dinner here in a little bit. Yeah, we're here a little bit earlier than dinner. So we're gonna head over and grab this chocolate thing for dessert at uh, a Giardelli's. It'll be pretty good, I hope. Dessert before dinner. Dessert before dinner, yep. yep. I don't think there's anything at this new restaurant we would get for dessert anyway, but we decided to get this first. There's Giardelli in the distance. We are heading over there right now. You got the boats over there. Got take you down to um, Port Orleans, Riverside. Even if you're not staying at Port Orleans and you want to take a nice little boat ride, those boats, it's like about a 20 minute ride to the resort approximately. And it is um, a really nice relaxing boat ride. It's nice to do that even if you're not staying there. So, I'm gonna catch up to Kira and John here. Um, I told them that I wanted to go into the Christmas tree store in the Christmas gift store down here. John thinks it's too early. I said it's never too early for Christmas, so let's see if we end up in the Christmas store today. If it's up to me and Kira, we'll definitely be in the Christmas store for sure. And here is Giardelli. <laughs> There's like a million calories inside of that um, place. They are, yeah. They are. They are, yeah. So what are, we, what are you guys thinking of? We're probably going to get the cookie crumble hot fudge sundae. This one here? Yeah. All right. You can bring the menu with us. Alrighty. They look like they have, geez, a world famous hot fudge sundae, platinum magical sundae. Wow, ocean beach sea salt, that sounds amazing. A mini bliss hot fudge, double chocolate, gold brush caramel almonds. Goodness gracious, and the list goes on. They look pretty amazing. And then they have uh, just like regular milkshakes in the back. Wow, they look really, really delicious. They even have the calories on it for people. <laughs> they shouldn't. <laughs> no, they shouldn't, not at all. Is this cookies and cream? Vanilla ice cream mixed with three chocolate squares right away. Nice. So this is the inside of uh, Giardelli. We have not been in here for many, many years. We're standing in a really, really long line. The line started outside. And uh, yeah, this is literally chocolate heaven in here. They have some really unique Giardelli chocolates here. One I've never seen. They actually have a crispy rice dark chocolate. And wow, pretty amazing in here. That cookie is awesome. The fudge is awesome. Yeah, the fudge is awesome. So this is the Giardelli chocolate crumble with hot fudge and definitely could feed more than two people for sure. Oh, and has a few Giardelli chocolates on the top as well. Small ones too. They don't give you the full size ones. This thing costs $20. Is it worth it? No. Really? This is not worth $20. I think that is absolutely sad. I realize this is different and things are expensive, but this is on another level. Would you get it again? No. Good. This have once. If you've never had it, go try it. It's a little distracting over here. It's very busy downtown today.
So look at the size of that. It's a teeny tiny chocolate. They don't even give you a full size one. Is there caramel in that? Yeah. Oh, that's yummy. She doesn't like it. So. You don't care? No. Just like caramel. I don't like that. I don't know how you guys are going to eat that and then us go to dinner. <laughs> Too bad uh, Kaylee and uh, Carrie aren't here to finish that off. <laughs> I think Carrie could eat that by himself. <laughs> So what kind of ice cream is that? Vanilla. Uh, vanilla. Uh, both. That one and that one is ice cream. The middle oh. one is vanilla. Oh. You can't get that far down there yet. Oh, okay. That's cookies and cream ice cream. I like cookies and cream ice cream. We do. I'm learning today. I used to love cookies and cream when I was younger. It's good. The cookies and cream. A cookie is okay. Think it's a cookie. Nothing to write home about. Really? Because I think those are the ones like in their batter. Like if you were to buy their Giardelli cookie tell, mix. I don't understand their obsession with Giardelli either. That was the first time we've ever been in a strong one. Always a bottle. But you what? It did move pretty quickly though, for sure. It moved quick. They, I just don't think it's like worth it. I don't think it's like the end of Well, that's kind of disappointing because I thought that was. cream ice cream that has like no flavor. Really? It might as well be vanilla. Really? Weird. Interesting. What about the hot fudge? The hot fudge is pretty good. That's good. So I have to say, when I was carrying it, my hand was definitely hot. <laughs> that means a good presentation was called out of it. Definitely with the little minis. They definitely had some flavors of chocolate in there that were very interesting that I haven't seen in the stores before. So, John, if you were going to rate that, what would you give that? <laughs> <laughs> well, Johnny, I know you're going to think. I say five. I mean, it's 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 good. I don't know if I can get past the price. I mean, it's good. It's not. I, I wouldn't ever think about this again. I'll put it that way. Really? It's good. But if I never got it again, you'd be fine with that. Kira, what about you? There's other stuff I would pick together yeah, for this. Exactly. I would not be like, oh, I gotta go to the Springs to get that. Now they have something on the side. Apple caramel. What's that? Apple caramel. Uh, yeah. Um, I forgot. I do have it somewhere on this video. What it was called? Yeah. That looks awesome. There is a kind of like, but that alone. It's like twelve dollars. Yeah. Definitely, definitely. Everything is expensive. Like to get a small is like ten or eleven dollars, but then to get a large is only fifteen. So it's like if you're already spent eleven for a significantly smaller size, then you might as well just get a larger size like there. Okay. Instead of getting multiple things. Okay. Um, well, definitely good to know. Well, they're definitely doing a good job on eating it. They're still. You can no see. Ice cream on tail. He did. Did he lick it off? No. I liked it up. <laughs> well, they are devouring it. We paid for it. So yeah, the other <laughs> drinks. The other drinks were fifteen ninety-five. The it's other expensive. milkshakes. Yeah. Yeah, that is a lot of money. I mean, it's just nuts. I mean, I know ice cream these days is pricey, but that's like that, like that. Yeah. I personally do love their little chocolates. Since that place opened for a very long time ago, 
there's always been a line. Like usually the line at like once like the peel white goes down after it opens. Yeah. The line goes down, but it, it never has been. Yeah. That stuff in there was free. The line was so long. Well, that is for sure. I just. Because the line outside actually what wrapped around twice before we even got inside. And then I think there was approximately three rows inside. Yeah, it's nice. They definitely had an assembly line of people working and a good system. The only reason we got this for you guys. <laughs> you all are here one time. Come check it out. Especially if you like Sundays. I mean, I would much rather go to beaches than cringe. Or someplace in Magic Kingdom. Uh, some, let's see, somewhere in Walt Disney World, other than this, for that, for something like that. You can get all of them. This seems just like. Minus the cookie and the square. It seems like a. I don't know, let me know some Deary Belly Square thing on it and call it fancy and charge an obscene amount of money. Isn't that awesome? It would be a generic Sunday. It's a generic Sunday. The, the, the chocolate chip cookie is not even that good. I would give that a two. The ice cream is okay. I give it a three. So there you go. I mean, it's. And beaches and creams cheaper. You can make your own Sunday, get whatever you want at a cheaper price. It's significant. I'd go so. get the kitchen sink. And beaches and cream is what I would do. Oh, that's. Kitchen sink is everything they have and a whole can of whipped cream. I think that's only 20 bucks. It's only 20 bucks. Oh, actually, I think it's 26.95 now. <laughs> Even then, <laughs> still, for the price of this. If yeah. You look at the size of this bowl. It's oh. Oh, a hunter person. It's probably 10 of those. So that... that's my answer for y'all. Skip this. Go get a kitchen sink if you great. All righty. So we're getting a Sunday. You get a Joe and Jose. Again, a regular Sunday. So this was dessert before dinner. For the next video, we're going to go over at the Turf Club, Saratoga Springs for dinner. We've never been there before.